My name is Tyler Burke and I'm the president and CEO of Turbine Technologies and we are a manufacturer of aerospace and uh, industrial gas turbine uh, components. There were a lot of uh, mom and pop or Fred in the shed shops like us in the aerospace industry, in industrial gas turbine industry. And the OEMs were very clear. Um, there's gonna be a, uh, a washing out period and you're either going to innovate, uh, you're either gonna invest, um, or you're gonna be rationalized. So we made the decision to invest, to, to innovate, and really embrace the fourth industrial revolution. The reason why we exist is to provide our customers with a competitive edge. The expectation at Turbine Technologies is every single part counts and every single part is uh, going to be built. So we, can, we, we do not have a, uh, a culture where it's acceptable to have, have fallout. People come from all walks of life, all around the world, and when you enter the military, you adopt a uh, universal set, set of values. We all know the Army values, and that is, is so important. You hire for character, and then you train the talent. Um, many of us started out as the enlisted soldier and worked our way all the way up to the top. So um, understanding what that person needs at the lowest level and operating at the senior level to ensure that that, that person has everything they need to get through their day, that's, that's the models that we're using. You gotta have the right tool for the right job. So what's good for, for me might not necessarily be good for someone else. We had it in mind that we were gonna go with a single company. The controllers have to be the same. You know, you know the support package and the, and the, the sales and the support crew um, for, for economies of scale, for consistency, and an EDM uh, consistency and flushing are everything. Part of the, the fourth um, industrial revolution that we're really cognizant about is removing barriers between people and machines. And the graphical user interface, the touch screen with the Hyper-Eye controller, um, this is a machine for the future. And this is a platform that's gonna service us, not just now in the tactical side, um, but will, helps us achieve our strategic goals. The thing that's important to me is that uh, when we have uh, any issue, SST is on site within a matter of, of hours. Um, the machines are up and running to meet my production. And if there is any kind of delay or issue, then Makino is involved in the solution to finding out how they can best help us. We needed to partner with a, an EDM machine tool manufacturer that had these similar values in mind. Um, and that is offering a platform that is going to be relevant in the future. There are aspects of this of the Makino machines that are really helpful for us in, in what we do. Uh, the breakthrough technology, uh, the ability um, to make shaped holes uh, or diffusers with the high-speed hole technology. You have the um, ability to make non-conformances when it's all done in a single work tank where you put the, the diffuser shape in and, and drill the hole all at the same time. That's really the way to go. We set up the process with, uh, with exceeding the customer's expectations, um, not from a marketing perspective uh, or, or any other perspective other than we want to make sure that the part, when it goes out, it's going to meet all of our customers' quality characteristic expectations. And so we're going to go beyond. It's the new products in the new machinery. That's what make the, makes the business case work for us, both on the technology side, financially, and that's what industry is asking us to do. 
you know, partnering um, with Mikino, partnering with our, our customer. It's really a multifaceted um, relationship and that will, uh, and that is propelling us to great heights.